Oh man, Bob, these shows about zombie survival isn't realistic at all. The first step to zombie survival is having a nice place to live, like our house here. Uh oh, what is that? The zombies! There are zombies here, Bob! What are they doing? Uh, uh, can they break in? I don't know if they can get in. Oh man, see what I mean? Really nice house that can't be broken into quite literally. Uh oh, what do we do? You know what? You just stay in here. It doesn't seem like they can get through walls. Okay, you know what? Grab my nice new shotgun here and just boom! Oh, oh, oops, I shot right through all my doors. We're gonna take out these zombies one by one. Take this, you jerks. Uh oh, uh oh, uh, they're quite strong. Holy man, there's a lot of them. Reload, reload, reload. There is a ton of them. Holy man, they're all over the place. Just keep blasting them. What the heck, why are they so strong? Okay, grab my sniper rifle and just go boom! Wait a second. Bang! This thing works really good. And I have an idea. Once we destroy all these zombies and a couple trees like that over there. Uh oh, uh oh. We're gonna build a zombie survival bunker. Get out of here, you jerks. Boom! Oh, wow. I think they actually just keep respawning. So, um, you know, it's fine. Retreat back into the house. Oh, they're right behind me. That's terrifying. Reload the gun. The house is on fire. Boom! Get in quick. Get in quick. Can they get in here? I don't know. Uh oh. What, what just happened? My house. No, Bob. Don't worry. I'll rebuild it. Get out of here, you jerks. <sighs> okay, the house is rebuilt. We're gonna go inside and we're going to build a zombie survival bunker. Right out back. Um, Bob, this is a great idea, right? Yep. So we're gonna go into the creative mode here and we're going to cut a hole in the wall here. This is gonna be like our escape hatch. So, you know, we could crawl out like this when the zombies show up. And right here in the ground, we're going to remove some of this uh, grass clutter. Uh, uh, oh, uh, oh, uh, oh. Okay, the game didn't like me doing that. And we're gonna grab the box here. We're gonna make our bunker out of metal. So let's just make a nice, nice, come on, a nice big platform that extends out quite a bit. Not too much. That looks pretty good. We're going to add some metal walls. I was hoping to do this underground, but it didn't seem to want to let me. So nice thick walls. Bang. Now we have to add a nice thick ceiling so they don't bust through the top and for the door i'm just gonna make a piece that i can move by hand just like this that looks like a pretty good door okay bob before the zombies show up you gotta get inside there i don't want to have to save you later just crawl right in buddy crawl right in oh he fits perfectly look at that whoa i mean i should have probably built this a little bigger but we're gonna test to see how strong this is i should probably add some furnishings in here we need like a bed and a couch and a tv or something like that and there it is this is looking pretty homey we got the television bob fell over i think he's a little tired we got the bed that he could lay on and take a nap on look at that perfect and our door you know what i'm gonna go out here and keep an eyeball out for zombies i do have this nice little high-tech drone that i can use let's just pop it out here look at this high-tech drone whoa we'll use that to see when the zombies show up and then run and hide okay this drone is spinning out of control i don't know what's wrong with it and uh oh they've arrived you know what use our drone powers to pick one up but oh that's a flamethrower oops um change the weapon to a grapple hook Pick one up and toss them. This is what you get, you jerk. Holy man, that actually worked really good. Okay, do the zombies know where I am? I don't know, but this, I ran one over. Okay, you know what? There's, get out of the drone. There's a zombie right past this wall. Um, okay, yep. Time to get into the bunker and hide like this and use our little door here to close up the entrance. Uh-oh, um, it's fine. It's fine, don't worry about it. Bob, we're safe. Bob is still tired. Holy man, there's a horde out there. They're breaking stuff. Uh-oh, okay, you know what? Gonna use the creative mode and I am going to pop a hole right there. Yep, they're right outside. They're trying to break in. They're trying to, they're trying to get us, Bob. Throw another hole right here, just like little peeking holes for us to see outside. Okay, you know what? I think I could probably, oh, I think I could probably shoot them through these holes and come on, uh-oh. No! There's all. Was that a zombie? That was a zombie. Oh, maybe it's not. Maybe it's just this gun that explodes. It's explosive ammo. I popped a hole in the bunker. Oh, no. Okay. Well, look at this. It kind of worked for a bit. But these zombies are going crazy. 
Why is there explosive ammo? I don't even know. Okay. It's okay. There's fire everywhere anyways. The house. Um. Oh, no. Get out of here, you jerks. There's zombies everywhere. Okay. Just, um, boom. Ow. You know what? Revengeance Katana. Turn this and go boom. Did I get them? I think I got, I got one. I cut one in half. Its legs are still coming after me. What? Okay. Find a nice spot to hide. Um, just start blasting them so they stop following me. What? What is with this ammo? All right. So, yep. The house is really on fire. There's still a bunch of zombies over there. But you know what? I'm going to make a car to escape. We're going to make a zombie survival car. So, is there like a box truck? <gasps> so, we can use like this box truck, right? And we can armor it up. Maybe we'll use the darker metal on this car here. We're going to add a couple um, pieces here. Because we're going to make a gigantic like plow thingy shield okay there's our gigantic shield on the front and now we need to add some side armor oh there's a zombie here dude get out of here get out of here got him got him okay for the door armor we're just gonna add like a nice metal sheet going across and also downwards this is gonna be really heavy but you know what more armor's better than no armor. And for the roof, we just had a nice big sheet going all the way across. Now this thing is looking armored. I'm going to add a couple of like windows on the inside for us to, you know, shoot out of. So we're gonna cut a big hole like this and there. On the back here, we're going to add a tiny door so we can go and rescue Bob and throw him in the back. And, you know, that looks pretty good. So let's hop in our truck. See how heavy this bad boy is. Oh my gosh, is it that heavy? Oh, it's a little heavy, but it drives. I wonder how armored this is. Stuff is already breaking on the inside. I think it's because of all the weight. It's fine. Oh my gosh, the house, it's crumbled. <laughs> Holy man. Is Bob still in there? Okay, you know what? We're just... Oh, the truck is already getting damaged. It's fine. We ran over a couple zombies already. Back this bad boy up to the house. We're going in to rescue Bob. Okay, hop out. Oh my gosh, there's a lot of them. Get inside and see if we can find Bob. Oh, here's Bob. Here's Bob. We just have to move this uh, debris out of the way. And before the zombies get him, get Bob on the truck. Bob, get in the truck. Bob, get, Bob, get in the... Uh, Bob, get in the truck. Uh, get in, get in, get in, get in, get in. They're hitting me. Oh, oh, oh. I mean, this is working, isn't it? Isn't it? Get my little gun out here and reload this. This is the normal ammo. It shouldn't hurt me and the zombies are already breaking in. Take that. Uh-oh. Okay, this little gun does a lot of damage to the truck itself, but bang. Boom. Okay, get in the truck, Bob. Get, I mean, get me get in the truck. We gotta go. We're going to the city. Okay, well, here we are. The box truck is fixed. Bob is in the back and we're just going to look for help. Uh-oh, I should not have hit stuff. Look, we got zombies in the city too. Run them over. Boom. Okay, there's only a few. They're just kind of migrating. Maybe let's go down over here and look. <gasps> Is that the military? Oh my gosh. And there's some human citizens. Pull up the box truck right here. This thing looks sick. I'm sorry I ran you over. <laughs> Back this thing up right there. And you know what we have to do? Bob. You okay in there? He looks fine. We have to defend the citizens by setting up some barricades, some turrets, and defend against the zombie onslaught and wait for a yacht to escape. It's like Left 4 Dead. Oh, this is going to be so cool. So let's grab a turret. Boom. That should save us. Now let's grab some military fence to add a perimeter around this place. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Okay, there we go. We have a fence uh, almost around the perimeter. Forgot this side. Don't want zombies getting in through there. There we go. Now we just need some spike strips. There we go. All around the perimeter, just like this. And we should be pretty defended. And now we just have to defend these people against the zombies. Grab my shotgun. Let's reload this bad boy. And here comes the zombie horde. Holy man. There is a lot of them. These turrets are just taking shots. Oh man, these zombies are strong. Oh, I don't know if we can actually just... The turrets aren't doing any damage. Reload, shoot. Reload, shoot. <laughs> Get out of here. They're kind of just standing there. The only one I know that works is the Barret. But I missed. Oh, I still got him though. Bang. Uh-oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, no, he got one of the soldiers. Okay, snub nose. I think this works too. Reload this. The turrets are just shooting. I think they're doing something. Oh, they are actually doing something. Bop. 
Where is this boat? We need to go. Bob, <laughs> call the boat to get here quicker. Oh my gosh, there is so many of them. Um, boom. You know what? I'm gonna have to call in heavy firepower. We need a gigantic bulldozer. Okay, here we go. I don't know why I picked a bulldozer. Uh, we gotta get that little thing on, on the back there up. That's the blade. Uh, rip her up. There we go. And the zombies just respawn. Okay, blade down. And here we go. Oh, man. That is so cool. I don't know if I've said, seen any movies or anything like that where they used a literal bulldozer to run over zombies. This is awesome. Okay, um... I don't know if it's really doing much damage, but it's distracting them. It's pushing them around. What if we push them into the water? Grab a few of them like this and just pick them up and throw them into the ocean. As long as they stay in front. Please stay in front. Okay, well, we got like one. We got we got two. We got one now. Okay, and no, stay on there. Stay on there. Blade up. Bl blade up. Thank you for standing there, zombie. And into the water. Bloom. Okay, uh-oh. Uh-oh. We need to get behind cover again. Watch out, turret. And look over there. We have the yacht. We have the yacht. Uh, you know what? I'm getting in this. This thing is too slow. I think that's the problem. No one's really driving it. Oh, no. The zombies are inside. They're eating the people. They're eating the people. Just, you know, hit this right there. Nice. Nice. You see that docking right there? Now we just got to pick up everyone and put them on the boat. There we go. Okay. Almost all the people aboard. Okay. And we just need a Bob from the inside. Bob! Uh-oh. Um, you know what? He's fine. Bob! There he is. <laughs> and we're getting out of here. See you later, zombies. We are, uh, we are scraping the boat on the edge of the island. Don't worry. We don't need that side. Oh, yeah. Uh-oh. Are we sinking? As long as, as, it, as long as it gets us away from the zombies, that's all that matters. And look at this. Look at all the people we have saved. Oh, wow. Where'd Bob go? Bob? Bob, hold on tight. Do not fall off the boat. Whatever you do. And I think this is a pretty good spot to sit back and wait for the military to do this. Boom! Oh, uh, maybe, maybe we're too close. We might be too close. Uh-oh. My truck, it got vaporized quite literally. <laughs> Look at all the pieces. Oh, I spent so much time on that. They nuked it.